far away You seem so far away When it was only yesterday That you were so close to me Enough! Hey, what's up, YouTube, man? Back with a quick video. This is Enoch 777. Shots out to everyone out there. Hope all is well. Y'all stay out of the way. Say focus and balance. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. I appreciate the love, the support, the comments. Thank y'all for watching all of my YouTube videos. The title of the video is going to be a question that one of my subscribers asked me. They wanted to know how to get to heaven this is a question that somebody asked me a little while ago and i know that some of y'all have y'all opinions about what you think about the concept of heaven and hell is and i have my own too and what i have to say is that we most definitely can experience a lot of different feelings if you want to say when it comes to a person saying that I'm in hell, I'm in heaven, I'm in purgatory, or whatever have you. I believe that there is a lot of experiences here now that a lot of different people is actually going through spiritually. Do I think the whole population is on the same level? No, that could never happen. Many different stories many different levels between good and bad so keep that in mind but yeah so before i started spirituality i questioned a lot of different stuff and the main thing was if god was real or not now i did still have my faith but i wanted answers because i needed to know so the more that I wanted it, if I wanted it bad enough, I am going to end up running across this information. So I had to feel it in my soul that I could get my answers if I try to find it and look for it. If I'm just sitting back and I'm procrastinating, I'm not going to find anything. I actually have to do the physical work. And a research in order to find this knowledge. I ended up going into this place. This place I never knew that it existed. Never knew it was real until personally I experienced it and I went there spiritually and it's here. You see what's around me? This matrix, everything is the matrix. You walk outside, your regular life, your friends you grew up with, the places you worked, the connections. It's all messed up because you woke up. So apparently something or someone wanted us to find out something about this reality. If they didn't want us to. Guess what? We will all still be just like the rest of those people that you see on a daily basis. We was living in a matrix. Something called us. Something came in with brutal force and snatched us up. I've been to a lot of different places and I'm standing right here. You could be going through so many different things in so many different dimensions on the inside, standing in front of a person, and they would never know because they closed off from the information. They don't know what's going on. How to move up the chakra system throughout the body. 
to open a pineal gland to get to the center of the heart, which is the gates of heaven. You unlock that. You unlock these gates and the doors to go to the other side. So I know where the angels is at. I'm talking about earth angels, real actual angels in human bodies that's here right now. I know where they at. See, the thing about heaven is, is that it's all about how you feel on the inside. If I feel peaceful on the inside, I have security, I feel love. Heaven is quiet. You hear that? Silence. Heaven is quiet. You know how they say, oh, people in heaven don't be doing nothing. They talking about you. They talking about you. What you do on a daily basis. So when you meditate, you cut people off, you spend time alone, right? You go to these places, these quiet places, that's heaven. You go back home, you get off of work, you hop in the shower, you get yourself straight, settled in, you hop in the bed, guess what? That's your throne. That is your heaven, your kingdom, right? <laughs> Do you even want to know what the freaking promised land is, right? It comes from our manifestation. That is promised to us if you just get up and do the proper necessary work. And then you will get to there. So, heaven is up. This is up where I am at. My vibration is high. My chakras are aligned. I'm up here in a higher dimension. So, if I decide to leave, turn on my phone, get on the internet... I'm descending and go walking, then I'm descending. I'm going down below, right? I'm leaving from my high place and going into a lower place. Heaven is here. It's real. A lot of people is already in it. The main people that is in it is these people that is within spirituality that is calling themselves spiritual beings. In a human body. You can experience. Heaven and hell. While you are alive. Here. It really just depends on what you are manifesting throughout the day. And what you have your thoughts on. Right. And how you are feeling. So if you are having negative thoughts. And you are putting yourself through this. Then you are making yourself go down into the bottom chakra. And into lower places. If you are feeling happy. And you are not letting your environment or the people affect how you feel on the inside. And you're vibrant, you're high energy, and you're loving, and you're peaceful. Then this is your heaven. This Enoch 777. Peace. I'm out. Love y'all.